Remember that God is all-powerful. There's not a single thing in your life, no problem that he can't handle, nothing that is too hard for him, no matter what you face that might create fear in your life. Please always remember, no matter what I'm going through that's making me afraid, God is far more powerful than that thing, okay? He's far more powerful than that thing. He is the all-powerful God. When the angel Gabriel came to Mary and said, Mary, you're going to be the bearer of the Christ child, and Mary's scratching her head and saying, how can this be? I've never known a man. How will it happen? And the angel says, well, the the, the glory of God is going to overtake you and overshadow you, and that one born of you, birthed in you, and conceived in you will be of the Holy Spirit. And and she couldn't understand it, but then the angel declared these words in Luke chapter 1, verse 37, for nothing is impossible with God. Nothing's impossible with God. So when things come your way that intimidate you and threaten you and look so big in your life and so monstrous in your life, remember who God is. God is the all-powerful God. Number two, God is completely faithful. This is who God is. He's completely faithful. By faithful, he'll never let you down. We sang it earlier. Will he ever fail you? We we declared it multiple times today. He won't, he won't, he won't, he won't. I'm not sure if that's correct English or not. I would say he will not, he will not, he will not. Okay. But the songwriter liked want, okay. But the principle being so true that God will never fail you, which means he is faithful. Joshua, the great elder of Israel. As he's now getting to his last days and he's going to pass on the blessing to the next generation because he's going to die. He's, it's all over for Joshua. And he says this to the people of God in Joshua chapter 23, verse 14. Soon I will die, Joshua says, going the way of everything on earth. Deep in your hearts you know that every promise of the Lord your God has come true. Not a single one has failed. He says, remember that. I'm going to be gone from here, but you must remember that every promise God gave has never failed. Why? Because God is faithful. That's who he is. Numbers 23, verse 19, God is not a man, so he does not lie. He is not human, so he does not change his mind. Has he ever spoken and failed to act? Of course not. Has he ever promised and not carried it through? Of course not. Paul says it this way. If we're not faithful... He will still be faithful because he cannot be false to himself. I love that verse, don't you? 